Hey everybody, PC Outcast here, back with more of Kingdoms of Amalur. So, what do we have to do? Return to Brother Holt. I have not been there before, so I can't actually return there. I don't think you can get there from there. So, I guess we're running... Uh... Wow, that map's not very helpful. We're gonna go this way, right? I hope. Oops, that is not what I wanted to do. So I have it on good authority that uh, you can actually use frost magic to slow enemies down, which is kind of sweet. Oops. Press the wrong button. Hello. Electric band. That too. Lightning damage and lightning resistance. Mm, not bad. Not too bad. What is this? Star camp. Oh. So the star camp does have a. Oh no, it has a two-way here? Okay. That's a little strange. Prodigy gloves. I don't have enough space. Never enough space for anything, man. Prodigy Gloves, Mana and Crit. Okay, we got Mana Regen 10% or Mana and plus 5. Oh, we don't have enough uh, finesse for that anyway. Yeah, I can definitely see how uh, finesse and um, magic, like a combination between those two could be good. Hey, we discovered St. Edric's mission. We got a chest to loot right. Well, there's that. Um, ooh. Okay, we gotta come back here after we sell some stuff. Hey. Oh, nope. Is there really no, uh,. No merchants here, or is this a merchant? Bunkhouse. Hmm. Kind of quiet in here. There's nobody. Oh, hello. Desk key. Can't take this. Oh, I can't take this. Put the key for this desk? Invoice. I don't really care about the invoice. No. Alright, well, we have a random desk key. Is there anybody in here? Magic oh. is in all things. Welcome to St. Edric's. There is magic everywhere, child. You need only to look and you will see it. I have been training an apprentice, Brother Wolf, in these things as well. One who studies under me can learn a great deal. 
Brother Wolf. He and I have been working to locate new and interesting crystals that may be of use in our alchemical experiments. I expect Brother Wolf is working diligently. And when he returns, I will accompany him on another expedition down into the mission well. Hmm, okay. Faru's blessings upon you, then. And, uh, that would be looting, and that would be... wrong. Looting... looting stuff that's marked red is wrong. Ah. That's the one storage case. No. There. This mysterious case is empty but holds traces of red crystal dust from whatever was once housed inside. On the front is a label that reads crystals from the well excavation. I. I don't know what that means. He does seem a little suspicious though. All right, let's let's turn this quest in. Oh, how I pray my ears deceive me then. <sighs> so it is true. The doubt in the back of my mind that was clawing its way forward is now here upon me. Thank you. Now, now I won't have to wonder any longer. Go in peace, child, and leave me to my prayers. Ah. Uh... Brother Holt? I came to St. Edric's to find peace. Peace and a place to study. It's quite scenic, and nature's beauty has always helped me think better. Puts my mind at ease. Nature's beauty does have a way of doing that. Um, mission. So much of the world around us is made of things we can look at, but never see. St. Edric's wants to show us a way to see those things. The meanings in them that go far deeper than their facade. Okay. Go with Mythology. You do that. Mitharu's protection. Okay, so we yeah, unfortunately there's some good loot here, but we don't have space for it. So it's back to good old uh Gorehart. For some selling. I mean, we collected a bunch of um, gear and weapons and stuff, so that's perfectly reasonable. You currently have no active quest. Don't worry, I'll select something. I cannot emphasize the importance of what you've done. You can by buying my stuff. Um. Ooh, these are actually slightly better. Okay, let's let's get rid of the get rid of the stuff we're not using. Um, these chakrams are equal to what we've got. Nine thousand gold. Wow. Those are pretty nice. It's got the bonus experience too, which is really nice. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't mind having that. This is sorcery, but we need to get the full set. So. The one we've got is better. Whoops. And I meant to actually look at the- oh yeah, I wanted to keep this for the socket. Now that Prodigy set is kind of nice. Talisman of Ice Aversion. Fine. Elemental resistance and blocks damage. Um, Bloodstone, 5% chance to steal health on hit, which is nice. 
it's a bit low. So I think I'm actually gonna get rid of that. Same thing with that. Physical elemental resistance and plus one sorcerer abilities is kind of cool too. Just resistances though. Bleed. Oops. Prodigy band is just extra mana. Problem there. Oh, I've got lots of. I already got too much loot. I need to need to get rid of some of this stuff. I also need to craft some things. I don't think I can sell the stolen stuff. Can I sell the skulls? There you go. And bones. Uh, not sure what I do with those things. Probably something super important, and now I've just thrown them away. Um, okay, so I want to keep that one because of the socket. I want to keep that in case I get more... I mean, I need, basically need the whole set of Lyra. Lyra's gear. Fey blades are slightly better than what we've got, but we don't have the bleed. I don't have any points into that anyway. And the Assassin's Dagger level 6. They're not bad. Extra damage versus humanoids. Okay. Until you destroyed those shipments, all We are positively loaded. Rolling in Dosh, you might say. Um, where can I do? Alchemy is in there. Healer. Merchant. Blacksmith. And yeah, we need to practice our alchemy, I think, a little bit. Um, need supplies. Try the corner shop. Fly to the corner shop. Got it. Alright, so we can make a uh, health regen. We can make one health regen. Is that really all we can cheapers? Out of all those things we've got? Okay, there you go. No more Scarlet Flowstone. Very sad. Some gold. Fay in Gorhard. It is. All right. Quests. Um, books found two of ten. Um, whereabouts are the others? Okay, there's this that we need to. We'll go to oh yeah this is this is like a big like map covering quest we can't actually get one pretty soon Inve investigate Ettenmere yeah you know what let's go do that we haven't been into Ettenmere yet Oops. What, what is this? There we go. Now, if we get um, stuff from that, we can maybe uh, make some more health potions. So it's good. Even those basic health potions are still, are you know, pretty decent. I assume this is the way through to the other side. Oh, it's the way into a nasty bug thing. Ow. Oh, there's lots of them. Yeah, that 
uh, I can stun dodge. It's kind of cool. Um, no, I'm not gonna bother. Honestly, got so much stuff. Rise. And... Secret loot. Chakrams of dusk and a bunch of gold. What are they? Um, same, same. Shock instead of burn. More damage at night. It's kind of cool. We are heading in the right direction, right? Yep. I was told of ancient days when wise priestess Beala Tyrion to goddess Lyria spoke. The people remembering all after war, called for Durek's fate. Slay them, the foul and wretched tribe, said Dokofar. Spare them, the poor and miserable beasts, cried Losolfar. Their minds, depraved and hatred poisoned, twisted. Alfar struck Alfar over drink, at feast, when all else is merry, when peace reigns in havens. Hateful, I am told, were cousins towards each other. From the cold-blessed Feriol, Beala Tyrion, with a head to seek Lyria's guidance, set forth on a pilgrimage. Oh, does that mean I can maybe find some more of Lyria's stuff? That would be nice. I say, isn't there anything we can do about all this uncivilization in these lands? We have magic and weapons. Should be easy work. But you could fit the bill. I'm part of an expedition to the Teeth of Naros, and we need another to come with us on the journey. Uh, what is this expedition all about? But as I said, we are going to the unexplored land south of Dalentorf. They're said to house unimaginable wealth. Our coffers will thank us when we get there. If you need more information, find our camp near Ettenmere and speak to our leader, Helic. Okay. Leave me. Now leave me now. I have important things to think about. Ooh, there's another XP thing, my dude. Lord Ferrara, valiant warrior, destroyer of Enfamenir, Duke of the Hylarans, protector of the Ring of Kiozai, discoverer of the island of Meropis. Were he only to meet a better end. Oop, oop, can, can we cross over there, please? Thank you. <laughs> Easy chest. There it is. It is, look at that. Um, I'll just take that. Oops. All right, we've got a halfling. Only one head by the mercy of the gods. I thought my time had come at last. Fate does not seem to hold much stock in my expedition, but it leaves me alive to see its utter failure through to the end. What's Good. What are you going on about, though? I was leading an expedition to recover a pair of Arathi artifacts, known only as Shine and Shadow. I've spent the last decade researching them. Texts say the artifacts are powerful, but what they can do is never explicitly stated. Regardless, the Templars feel it best to place such items under their guard. But the Etin have hit us hard. And it's said that the artifacts are guarded in Dalak, by an ancient, powerful shaman of their kind. I'm at a loss for what to do. Well, I'll try to recover them, I, I guess. I have not had such good news in some time. My research indicates that the artifacts are somewhere in Delac. It seems they're now a trophy of the Etin. I can promise you this much. 
Though my expedition was underprepared, it was not underfinanced. A large reward waits for one who finds the artifacts. What exactly are Etten? Ah. Their impudence seems tied to their devotion. From what I can tell, a small number of prominent shamans are rallying them. If someone had a head on their shoulders and a blade, then toppling those shaman would help pacify the area. All right, uh, where are Shine and Shadow? My research has tracked them to Delac. There is talk of an ancient guardian. From the looks of this place, it's likely some Etin. Okay. Seems reasonable. Ooh, 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 this could be Scarlet, but we didn't get any. Damn. There ain't no fish today, stranger. It's best you look elsewhere. Ugh. Can't even look a fish in the face anymore. Not ever since I met that nymph. You met a nymph? I can remember when I first saw her on the cliff to the south, overlooking Ettenmere. I saw that watery maiden and I fell in love with her. I've outlived my Imelda. My nephew Thaddeus up and left for Dyden Hill for want of never seeing me again. I had a chance of ending loneliness, but it was taken from me. The beasts of the wild scared her off. We were to wed by my peer, but I ain't seen her for days now. I'd search, but the monsters will rip me to shreds. I'll kill the monsters. I bet you could indeed, but that's only half of what's needed. You must also find my bride to be. Then the wedding will be upon us. I have, I've got to find the ring. I, I need to find my bear musk. I need to prepare. You best start bear by the musk. Peer. If she's not there, keep heading south. She's bound to be somewhere. Go on now. I will ready myself for the wedding and then catch up to you. Do you think that, you know, maybe she's not interested in you and she left? But where can I find her again? I don't know why it, it like, we just asked this and then... Just told us and now we get I was to meet more her information. I don't know. But the gentle creature got scared by the monsters, no doubt. I first laid eyes on her from the cliff overlooking the lake to the south. I bet if you head south, you'll still find her. Okay. Uh, can you tell me more? Oh, I can rent a bed for 300. Uh, can you tell me more about your bride? I've seen a few fine women in my day. Even met a fey woman in Gorehart long ago. But that nymph, she's something else. Her skin's luster, her heaving prow and ample stern. Uh, except for the fishy parts, I mean. But even so, I've fished this lake enough that the form is uh, pleasingly familiar. Weird. Okay. Please find my nymph. Please find my nymph. Uh, okay. Oh, is this the uh, bed I can sleep on? Well, a mat. Okay. That's, oh, that's that. And then there's, oh, we have more quests. That's what we have. Oh, no. Fisherman's Bride. Okay, that's not far away. Let's go check that one. Unfortunately, this is sort of a isolated island here. Looks like there's only one way in and out. Well, we've got... Wolfs. Wolfies. Okay, what in the hell is this thing? Yeah. Okay, we got a... Get wrecked! There she is, my lovely bride. 
I am all dressed and prepared for our wedding. Thank you, stranger. Bless you. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to seal my bond with a ring and a kiss. Any last words for the crusty bachelor? I don't see a nymph. <laughs> my nymph? She just felt that disgusting etting with a glance. <laughs> Beauty kills even the beast, so they say. Did you not see her wiggle away to the cliff overlooking the lake? It's where we first met, you know. A grand spot for our union. Well, friend, if there's nothing else, I'm off. You're welcome to witness the event if you care to. You're delusional. It's your funeral. Uh, I killed the Etten. What are you talking about? That was my nymph. Have you not heard tales of them? It's staring you right in the face. Well, I'm not going to stand here and suffer the unfounded insults you keep slinging. I'm going to my wedding. Here goes nothing. Okay, well, good luck with that. And... Oh, stop regenerating. Uh, yeah. So she was luring you to... A very unpleasant end, I assume? A loot pile. That was no nymph, stranger. I just... You see enough sadness in your life and... You look for hope where you can. But you were good enough to save me from that beast. Now, I ain't a rich man, you know, but I do have this to give you. It's my wedding ring. Now, I don't mean nothing by it. I've pissed on Imelda's memory enough. Seems fair I give up what hasn't been taken. What of Imelda... What of Imelda's has been taken? It ain't much. Just a small charm that she had when we were wed. When fever took her, I mounted it on her grave. And then one of those two-headed bastards pried it off. Carried it to the lake, giggling like a pair of fools. Wouldn't dare follow the beasts there. But if you... Ah, well, you've helped me enough. I'll get the charm for you. Thank you. you. are a kind soul indeed. The Etten took to the shore as soon as I saw him. He's somewhere on the lake's edge, I'm sure of it. And uh, where's the charm? One of those Etten took it and headed south. Along the shore. He's somewhere on this lake. I know that much. Okay. Hello there. <laughs> uh, what a mess. So brief his term among our court. So virile in his living. He is fervent embodied. He is vitality. He rescued Princess Luna to take as his own. King of Strand. Prince of Passion. I did select Chen Shadow, right? Nest by whoever. The lone survivor of a gnomish expeditionary force to infiltrate Dalak. Okay, I gotta still find that. Missing charm is somewhere. Somewhere on this lake. What kinds of loot piles? Can I jump down? Nope. I think he's stuck. Got that, that stuck look about him. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with this loot chest right here, or it couldn't possibly have uh, any problems with it with a bunch of skulls and things. Nah. What could possibly go wrong with that? something like that? No ingredients found. You're breaking my heart, game. Oh, 
Okay, that's that's the two-headed one. Oh, oh, oh. Azurite. Chakrams. Um, more damage. Shock over time has... Doesn't have the crit chance. But... It is kind of nice. Yeah, let's... Uh, try that for a bit. Kind of a combination of... Um, lightning and lightning. Oh, we missed some loot. Okay, so there's something here. Well, hello, what is this? Finally, we found the last person we need after all. I'm Helic Cross. I'm leading an expedition to the land south of Dalantarth, the teeth of Naros, and we could use another strong back. Uh, do you know much about the teeth? Few facts. The only record of a successful journey there was by an Almain missionary named Denric, returned half dead and maddened to hell. <laughs> He claimed the southern land as home to a miraculous city, wrought of gold and trimmed with silver. Even said it floated above the earth, if you can believe it. It's hard country, damn impossible to find a pass in the mountains. But if I'm right, this cavern will take us under them. Hmm. Why do you need me? Because Denric wrote of more than wealth. Tales of giant men, tall as houses, that slaughter any who approach. It took weeks even to convince Cash and Sferi to join me. With a fourth, we can take a bigger haul without sharing too much of it. Uh, you believe a madman. Denric was crazed, but I don't hold him a liar. I can overlook some bogeyman's tales if there's riches to be had. Can you? Of course. Uh, I'll do then it. we only need to begin. I've seen to all the logistics and all the preparations for the journey. Meet us in the Southern Passage. Let's try to cover as much ground as we can. Sounds good. And where is the Southern Passage? It's the cave next to camp. I heard rumors that it was filled with artifacts that none had ever seen before. Strange carvings and huge works of stone. I don't know how dangerous it is, but I advise against being too carefree inside. We should go in as a group. Sounds good. Stay close. But we will do that in the next episode. Thank you very much for joining me, guys. We'll see you then.